When we think of bananas, we think of yellow sweet fruit. But has it ever crossed your mind of making furniture made from bananas? Yes, you've heard it right. Furniture is made from bananas. As you can see, I am surrounded of hundreds of banana trees. And these banana trees are left to rot. And we, the researchers, came up with an idea on how to utilize it. Banana fibers are usually used to create mats, ropes, and twines. But to take it to the next level, this here is a fiber board. Fiber boards are used to build furniture and also for structural purposes. Banana stems are usually discarded and left to rot as only 10% of the pseudo stem is used to create products. And these leftover stems produce methane gas that is one of the greenhouse gases. So why not utilize it as it is a renewable resource? The Philippines is one of the top 5 exporters of bananas. And it is no wonder that Filipinos have created different ways of it such as textile fibers for mats, ropes, and twines. <laughs> To create these fiber boards, the researchers manually extracted the fibers from the stems by cutting it into small cubes and pounding it with a hammer mallet until fibers were shown. It was then soaked in a large pail and strained to obtain the fibers and discard the excess. The researchers manually shredded it too to make sure that the fibers were produced. After the fibers were extracted, the researchers mixed the banana fibers with the bonding agent. As for this research, they used epoxy. The mixture was thoroughly mixed until homogeneity was obtained and was then poured into the molder. It was then left to dry under the sun for 72 hours. The epoxy was used as a bonding agent to hold the fibers together. Epoxy has excellent resistance against acid, alkalis, oils, and salt water, and also exhibits outstanding adhesive strength and mending capabilities with excellent impact and mechanical strength, making it a good choice of a bonding agent for fiber boards. This fiber board right here passed the standard set for particle boards, including its physical strength, water absorption, thickness swelling, and density. Check this out! Not only that, this is also cost-effective as the only thing you'll spend money on will be the bonding agent, which could be organic, resin, or epoxy. The selection of proper materials is important to the creation of just about any product. When it comes to furniture, choose for well-tested with low-cost options that are both environmentally friendly and cost-effective. Here we have a box. This isn't just your typical ordinary box made out of wood. It is manufactured from the banana stem fibers. Not only that, but we have other samples that can just show of what the banana fiber parts can do. that one day, the banana fiber boards can be used as an alternative material for furniture and would solve the excessive production of agricultural waste in the Philippines and provide more job opportunities for the people who need it, such as farmers. And that's our study! <laughs>